Hello you guys, welcome to the weekend vlog. It is Friday night, the sun is setting so everything looks orange, I apologize. I am home alone, Mariana's gone on a camping trip. She gets back tomorrow evening. We're going to round two of the Newfoundland Growlers playoff game um, tomorrow night and I'm taking a lot of her international friends. There's nine international students going with me. <laughs> I'm excited, it's gonna be a lot, but it's gonna be fun and I'm excited, I've met most of them. I'm excited to meet a couple of other ones. Squiggy's bringing some of her friends as well, so I get to meet the whole squad, which is really nice. So tonight we're staying home, we're being productive. I need to vacuum, fold the towels that are out there, down there somewhere, can you see them there? Right there, they're there, my hands over them. Um, do that, but first we're gonna watch some YouTube. Currently watching Alfie Days. Okay. Um, and it's really loud. He's the Bluetooth really speaker. Nice. He just hit one billion views on his vlog channel, so congratulations, Alfie. Um, and I'm also making supper with my Santa Claus spatula and a, an overboiled pot. I'm making craft dinner because hashtag lazy. So we're gonna eat. We're gonna move to the couch and watch a bit more YouTube. And then we're gonna go on a cleaning binge. The goal is to get all the house done tonight. Um, and then in the morning, tomorrow morning, do my weekly meal prep and then take on the weekend. So tonight's gonna be a weird one. I hope you enjoy. I went out last night with um, Marianne on Squig and we went to Winging It down on Hebron Way and we went to Walmart and we just ran life errands, but I didn't vlog. I was so tired, I was so burnt out last night. Finished watching part two of Sabrina last night as well. Marianne was into that show, so we watched it together, which is why it took me a week to watch it versus just binging it. Loving it. Okay guys, I don't want to turn on the lights because I don't want to be like weird and creepy, but I was just like, I was just finishing up in the kitchen and I turned off the lights and I had like the Bluetooth speaker on and I was clearly jamming out and I had it up really loud. And then I saw these flashing lights outside and I was like, what the hell's happening? Um, and there are like, ooh, sorry. There are like a million cop cars outside. Cop car. Um, <laughs> they're everywhere on my street. And I look out and the house across, the, like they're all down there. Can you guys see that down there? Yeah, see they're everywhere. I look out and there's cops and all of the teenagers in the house across the street are in the middle of the street. And I think there was like a fight or something. And all of the cops are over there now and dealing with the teenagers. And I'm like, what the hell just happened? It was quiet here. Like, oh, I'm texting. Megan, who lives next door, and she's like, what is going on? <laughs> and the two of us are like, we're both home alone tonight. What is happening? Um, deadbolts on, obviously. I've lived here almost five years, guys, and this street is quiet. Like, the most we ever get is an ambulance, and like, cause there's older couples on the street. Um, yeah. Low key, like, insanity. Anyway, whatever's going on has been broken up. And oh, it looks like the cop cars are leaving, but holy crap! <laughs> Friday night is lit! <laughs> um, yeah, this is why I keep to myself. Anyway, but seriously, our, my street is not like this usually. That was a first, like holy crap! Anyway, you're welcome, I hope you enjoyed that. I'm gonna go talk to Megan now, so. Ah! Okay, the cops have gone, but these idiots will not shut up. They just put away their baseball bats and hockey sticks. They've been chasing each other and trying to hit each other all night. And they've been screaming all night. And now they're just playing catch in the middle of the freaking road, guys. Like, they're gonna become road pizza soon. It'll be funny. I have no sympathy for people who are like that. Anyway. Also, I don't know where their parents are, but man, they should learn how to parent. Um, making cookies. I was just on the phone with my nan. I'm gonna give mom a call now and see who won the hockey game. Woot woot. Okay, update, it is 11.15. We're doing a little bit of kitchen clean up. I finished making the cookies. Um, for some reason, they did not come out and I said, oh, I ended up throwing them out. They, I think the baking soda's gone off. So anyway, whatever, you live and you learn. So anyway, we're gonna clean up. We're gonna turn the dishwasher on. We're gonna fold the last load of laundry. All of the housework is done. Um, Lola should be home in about 45 minutes. I am just waiting for, I'll show you, hang on, let's go. So yeah, I have to put all those towels away. <laughs> Life problem one. Um, 
I'm really proud of how nice the bathroom was cleaned. Um, I'm waiting for Blue Bloods to stream and I have to fold all that laundry. So, I'm going to call it, guys. I will see you tomorrow morning for a, another installment of the, of the vlog or continuation of this vlog. <laughs> okay, bye. Yo, Blue Bloods after midnight. Good morning again. My furriest, friendliest friend. You're just not in the mood this morning, are you? Do you want your breakfast? Because it's been out there for like four hours waiting for you. You're not feeling well today, boo? Why are you so shaky this morning? Do you want to go pee pee? What's wrong? Lola, not in a good mood this morning. Is it okay? We all have those days. Oh, what? What's up? Who's a good girl? Do you want your vitamin? Thank you for the kisses. Do you want your puppy vitamin? Let's go. Do you want to go get a treat? Then get your breakfast and you can do your pee pee? Yeah? Okay, let's go. Rawr. Let's go. Are you a happy puppy now? Okay, let's go. Mommy race you. Come on. Come on. Come on. Let's go. Oh, we're going to choke on the air. That's our normal routine. Let's go. Come on. And you do. You want an uppy. You want an uppy. What kind of doggo are you? You are a lazy doggo. Let's go. Let's go out the back door and then mommy get you your breakfast. Come on. Let's talk for a second about the importance of recycling. Uh, we had this conversation at work the other day and some people I work with are like, man, it's too much work. And I'm like, how is it too much work? You're saving the environment. And aside from that, guys, like, um, ultimately, not only are you making the environment a safer, better place, but like, you're cutting down on your garbage. And I think that's what people forget the most when they recycle. Like, for me, She's ready to come in that fast. Um, I have one to two blue bags a week of recycling and unfortunately the city only collects the blue bags every two weeks. So I accumulated a large amount of them. But weekly, like on average, I don't even have a full bag of garbage anymore unless I am like gutting out things and there's like some serious cleaning happening. Um, and it's just so important to recycle your plastics and stuff. I mean, we're just trying to make the world a better place, and the fact that it got this bad is just really sad. So, there you go. That's my two cents on recycling. Um, yeah, so now let's unload the dishwasher kind of put together. We have the hockey game this evening. I have to go to the gym now shortly, and then we're gonna get a shower. Hi. I say I went ham out here last night. Holy crap. I know I did a lot of cleaning and stuff, so I'm sorry this vlog's kind of dull, but it'll get better. There will be some hockey game footage this evening, so yay for that. Um, but yeah, I think that's all I wanted to say, so I guess I will stop recording now and unload the dishwasher. Sorry. Got me some lunch. Got me this one. She's got her, what did you get a booster juice? Mango hurricane with an energy booster. We just worked out, guys. Now we're waiting on the kids. Woot woot. First question, why is it every time we come out, Lola ends up getting something weird? Unicorn sweater, which she likes. I think this is adorable. I want a small one. I, how much are they anyway? This is something Shane Dawson would buy for Cheeto. True. <laughs> why do I always go back to Shane Dawson? I don't think I pay $30 for it. I think it's, I think it's not a bad price for a bed. It's just whether they use it or not. If if she would use it, I yeah. would, but exactly. I know damn That's well she won't. But I love it. Like, I could see it in the corner of the bedroom, you know? This is pretty. I should get something like this going in the future for the cats. It looks nicer. Okay, anyway. gold and white and platinum.
Okay guys, I just did all my skincare for the night. I'm calling it quits. I think I'm gonna end the vlog here actually. Come on, Lola. Um, give this video a thumbs up if you enjoyed it. Hit subscribe, turn on notifications, and I will see you super, super soon. I love you guys. Bye.